My amendment to House Bill 4001 would keep the income tax rate at its current level for those who make more than $70,000 a year, while reducing the income tax for those who earn less, ensuring working families a tax cut. I came to Lansing with the expectation that we would be representing the best interests of working Michiganders, that we would fight for our neighbors and the communities they reside in. Instead, this bill as it was introduced puts first the interests of the DeVos class of billionaire donors and special interests. I agree that working families and retirees in our state deserve tax relief. However, they also depend upon their local government to provide basic services. Services like public safety, especially our police officers, firefighters, and first responders. Local communities rely on their state government for financial support and providing these vital services. However, for over a decade, our state has neglected this responsibility. The cities and townships I represent have been shortened $31.4 million in revenue sharing over the last 15 years. They've had to make difficult decisions to stay afloat. They've acted in fiscally responsible ways even when the state has refused to. We cannot push them any further. Even the governor himself has expressed hes hesitation in supporting this bill as it was introduced because it fails to address how it would replace revenue the state would lose. Instead of decimating our state budget, let's maintain revenue and provide tax relief for those who need it. I believe this amendment accomplishes that goal. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I urge a yes vote on my amendment. Thank you, Representative. The question before the House is on the adoption of the amendment. The clerk will open the board. The amendment is not adopted.